All right, uh, in this video, we'll uh, go through startup and basic driving. So um, our power has been turned, electric circuit breaker is on. That's the first thing we did. We're gonna go ahead and click the starter for engines. You'll notice all these lights illuminate and the lights on the dash will flash as well as the uh, marker lights and tail lights and headlights. Um, they'll flash uh, just simulating as you're starting, you'll have low volts and it will uh, flicker the lights. Um, you'll notice our mirrors will come on at that point. Um, we're going to want to wait till our uh, RPS gets above 5. Um, that's our idle RPS. The reason it's doing that is to charge the battery. So if we, uh, if you immediately start it, it's not above 5, you could stall it, but with auto restart, it's not a big deal. Uh, we'll quickly go through the shifter. So right now, this is in um, automatic mode. It defaults automatic. That's your button here. If you click that, that goes into manual mode. So currently when first gear, if I click one, that's uh, to shift up. This is a Eaton Fuller 13 speed uh, pattern. So um, shift back down, that's one, that's two, three, four, five. Going to six, you can hear a, a beep. That beep is simulating the range selector from when you go down from the low end of the box to the high end of the box, so we're in six. We're gonna hear another beep when we go to seven. That simulates the splitter. Uh, gonna go into eight. We're gonna hear another beep for nine. Going to 10, another beep for 11, 12, and the last beep for 13. Now, if we wanna go into reverse, um, I have it as hot key to six. That's just in inadvertently hit reverse. Notice it goes into the reverse position, dog leg forward and to the left, and we got our reverse indicator on. So we're gonna go ahead and start in one. So one way you can reset the box, let's say you're in 10. So we'll hit six to get out of reverse. So let's say you're all the way up in say, I don't know, 13. If you're in 13th gear and you want, and you stop and you wanna get back into first, instead of clicking all the way down, if you hit six for reverse, and then you click it one more time, it'll put you back into first, so it resets the box for you. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and start driving. We're above five. We're gonna release the parking brake. You notice the light went out. Um, if we zoom out, you notice the markers are on. And if I hold the brakes, they're gonna flash. That shows us that we're in ABS mode. Once they go solid, that means they're solid on. We also have markers in the front. All right, here we go. So um, right now we're in manual, so we'll switch to automatic. So in automatic mode, which is default, um, we can just use W and S to drive. And if you watch, both our gear shifter and our indicator are going up. It will skip gears on the way up, right about there. Once it goes in the high range box, that's um, because this truck is meant to both tow and uh, drive by itself. So um, I wanted it to have nice, easy driving and fast driving when you're bobtail and when you're towing a trailer or you're uh, towing a vehicle. Um, it has a more realistic truck feel to it. So we're gonna do a quick U-turn here. As you can see, we're in 11th gear. Um, the shift point on this is uh, about seven and a half RPS, I believe, if I can remember where I set it. And so we should auto shift there. This is also manumatic, so if I clicked one, you notice how I went up in, in gear. And if I go up again, um, it also auto downshifts. So if you noticed, if I click it up, it's gonna stay back because it would otherwise stall out. If I wanted a lower gear, I could go lower. And once this hits 7.5, you'll notice it'll automatically upshift. So 7.5, uh, that will click into the next gear. And there we go. We're in now left back into 11. All right, so if we come outside, we slam the brakes, you'll notice first we get ABS, and then they'll go solid on. Put our parking brake back on. And again, we're in a high gear. If we wanted to uh, bring it back down, we can just double tap the reverse. All right, that's basic operation. Uh, thanks for watching.